When used together, Windows Small Business Server 2011 Standard and Windows 7 Professional provide a range of tools and technologies that help you get more done, safeguard your work, and gain more IT control and flexibility. In this video, we'll look at working smarter, enhancing team productivity, and working from virtually anywhere by leveraging the laptop support features in Windows 7 and SBS 2011. One of the key challenges faced by many small businesses is the difficulty in integrating laptops into their server environments. For example, some users may use their laptop in the office, on their home networks, and on other networks such as client computers or other locations. It can be confusing when they switch from one network to the other, especially for things like printing. Often users end up trying to print to the wrong printer depending on the location they're at. Another common problem is that users copy documents onto their laptops or USB flash drives so they can work away from the office. But this can cause problems when they return to the office. Version control becomes an issue, and if users aren't careful, hours of work can be lost, a costly mistake in many small business environments. It can be very tedious and waste even more time when trying to manually synchronize and integrate all the latest changes from everyone who may have worked on the document. Many people use SharePoint to help address these challenges, but unless they know they'll have a good internet connection, users are still likely to just make copies from SharePoint. And not all users remember to check out the documents to help avoid document conflicts. Another common complaint for laptop users is shrinking battery life. Older laptops may not provide the battery life that they need or give an accurate picture of how much battery power is still available. So let's look at how Windows 7 Professional and Windows Small Business Server 2011 work better together to solve some of these common business scenarios. One of the great new usability features in Windows 7 is location-aware printing. You can now set up a default printer for each network to which you connect, the office, home, or other sites. So when users go to print their documents, they're automatically directed to the correct printer based on where they're working. To help solve document version issues, Windows 7 and SBS 2011 give you a better set of tools and controls for working with offline files and folder synchronization. You can use folder redirection to store common local files on the server, such as the desktop and documents folder. And of course, using shared folders on your SBS server means that all the data is protected and backed up on a daily basis. And you can use the Windows 7 Professional Offline Files feature so that when users are away from the office, the server folders are still available, as if they were still connected to the network. And then when they come back, changes are automatically synchronized. And if more than one person has updated the documents, they can choose to save some or all of the changes. For SharePoint documents, you can use the integration features of Office 2010 to create a similar offline folder experience. Simply choose Connect to Outlook for each document library you want to synchronize with your laptops. This allows users to access their information directly from within the interface that they use most often. Windows 7 Professional also provides improved power management features, including dimming the display and the ability to dynamically adjust power usage features right from the battery meter in the taskbar. Now let's take a look at using these features in action. To take advantage of location-aware printing in Windows 7 Professional, we can open up the control panel and view our devices and printers. When we select a printer, we have the option to manage the default printers for the different networks that we connect to. So we can select a specific network and then choose which default printer we want to use on that network. To set up folder redirection for client computers in the Windows Small Business Server 2011 environment, go to the Shared Folders and Websites tab in the Administration Console and click on the Redirect Folders for User Accounts. From here, we can select which folders we want to redirect to the server. This can really help laptop users to be able to work in the way they're used to, but still maintain a central backup of all your business critical data. And this can be done for individual users or all users in your environment. With folder redirection turned on, even when laptops are disconnected from the network, they can work with locally cached copies of the files. On your Windows 7 professional client computers, you can manage offline files using the Sync Center. It's also easy to make shared folders on the SBS server available to laptop users when they leave the office. Simply select the shared folder that you're interested in and make it available offline. Now Windows 7 has a locally cached copy that it can use to access the data, and when users return to the office, the changes are automatically synchronized. 
For files that are stored in the company web SharePoint site, we can easily make these available to laptop users as well. Simply go to the Library tab and connect your document library to Outlook. This synchronizes those files and makes them available right within the Outlook user interface. Users can then access their documents under the SharePoint List section in the Offline Documents folder. And the same send-receive process that synchronizes email and calendar information will also synchronize these documents. We can also adjust our power options from within the control panel. From here, we can select the desired power plan or change any of the plan settings. In the Windows Small Business Server 2011 environment, you can also use Group Policy to enforce power options. You can also adjust your laptop's power usage from the Windows Mobility Center, which is available from the battery meter icon in the taskbar. In the SBS 2011 environment, a group policy is automatically created to disable power management on Windows 7 and Vista computers. This prevents the computers from going to sleep so that they can be accessible via remote web access when users want to connect to them from remote locations. You can decide to turn on power management for your client computers, but remember this may cause computers to be unavailable when your users want to connect remotely. You can also choose to create custom group policies to turn on and off power management for select computers in your environment. To learn more about the Better Together features of Windows Small Business Server 2011 Standard and Windows 7 Professional, visit our product homepage, join our Facebook community, and find a partner on Microsoft's Pinpoint site.